There are many ways you can add tasks in Gantt Excel. When you create a new Gantt chart in Gantt Excel, a default task is already added. So I'm going to modify this default task and type in here, Architectural Design. Now the first method is to click on the Add Task button on the Gantt menu in the Excel ribbon. Select the Add Task at Selection button. Type in the task name. The start date is set to today by default. Click the OK button when done. The task is added to the plan with the default duration of one day. You can also add a task by selecting the Add Task below Selection button. In this case I'm going to select a date by clicking on the estimated start date text box. As soon as you click inside, the date picker shows up so that you can select a date easily. I'm going to enter 3 days as the duration and the estimated end date is automatically calculated. I'm also going to click the Get from Estimated button to copy the same dates into the baseline dates as well. Let's set the estimated cost to be 2000 US dollars. Click on OK when done. The next method to add a task is to just double click the cell type here to add a new task. The same task details form shows up. In this case let me make this task dependent on the previous task. Don't worry about task dependencies for now. We will cover this in a future video tutorial. Click on OK when done. Lastly and the easiest method is to type in the cell, type here to add a new task. The moment you click outside or hit enter, the task is added. So that's pretty much it. Let's explore how to set parent and child relationships in the next video.